This area seems to be in disarray. I wonder if this is recent. Fucking head will show up. Let's get his legs clean off. Good work. Don't leave anything behind. Yes. Remain vigilant. This place may appear abandoned, but that doesn't mean we should drop our guard. There isn't much left to properly identify these remains.
Whatever this thing was, it's been totally torn to pieces.
Excuse me, Paladin Dance. Look at this place. You must hate these mutants as Look at this place. You must hate these mutants as much as I do. Why do you hate super mutants so much? They're responsible for the death of a close friend, a brotherhood knight named Cutler. So when you ask if I hate them, I say hate's too gentle a word. These monstrosities are just another example of man blindly taking a step forward, only to wind up stumbling two steps back. I've been fighting for years, trying to put a stop to this madness. And just when I thought we were getting the upper hand, along come the synths. I've seen what these super mutants do to people. Can you imagine what the synths would do to us if they ever got the upper hand? It would be Armageddon repeated, and maybe the end of everything that we hold dear. <sighs> Look, I don't mean to bore you with my rhetoric. I just want you to understand how important these missions are. Makes sense. Anyway, that's enough of that. What's important here is that you got the job done and secured these warheads. You should head back up to the Pridwin and talk to Maxon. I'm sure he'll want to debrief you as soon as possible. Dismissed. should head back to the Fridwin. I'll take care of the shells and the mess. Commonwealth looks bad. Outstanding work at Fort Strong, soldier. What happens at Fort Strong now? Paladin Dance is supervising the transfer of the Fat Man warheads to the Prudwood. They'll provide quite an edge to our arsenal. I've also ordered a detachment to occupy the location, and use it as a staging area to protect the eastern side of the airport. All in all, you handed us quite a valuable location. Too bad it wasn't the Institute. Not to worry, Knight. You'll be dealing with them sooner than you think. In order to bring the Institute to its knees, we need to use every weapon at our disposal. I try to supply my soldiers with the best. That's why I'm giving you these. Signal grenades can call a vertebrate to your location when you need aerial transport. Simply throw one to the ground, and the vertebrate will hone in on the unique electromagnetic smoke it emits. Once you're aboard, use the map on your pit boy to interface with the pilot's navigation system, so he'll be able to take you wherever you need. Thank you, Elder. I'll make good use of them. I expect that you will. Now. I'm sure you're aware that Fort Strong was simply the first step towards the liberation of the Commonwealth. An even greater task lies ahead. By now, I'm sure you've deduced that our arrival in the Commonwealth wasn't coincidental. We're here because of a unique energy reading recorded by Paladin Dance's recon team. According to our scribes, the reading indicated a level of technology that only the Institute could achieve. The moment this information came to light, our mission became clear. 
the Institute, and everyone responsible for the creation of the Synths, must be eliminated at all costs. To accomplish this goal, we need to locate the Institute's headquarters. I've had our scribes meticulously searching the Commonwealth, but they've come up empty-handed. Where do I start? I want you to get out there and become our eyes and ears on the ground. You seem to have a vested interest in locating the Institute before we met, so I'm confident you'll travel in the right circles. If you discover a way in, I need you to report it to me immediately. Any questions, Knight? What about those energy readings that Paladin Dance's recon team detected? Our scribes are confident that the energy readings are from Institute technology, due to the unusually high frequency. But the source is unknown. We're still detecting them on occasion. But by the time we set a team to investigate, they disappear. Just watch your step. I wouldn't be surprised if the energy reading were caused by some type of institute weapon. Is there anything else? Aren't there any pre-war records about the institute that might help us? Our records indicate that the institute was born from the remnants of a pre-war educational facility. The Commonwealth Institute of Technology. The ruins of the facility are at the center of the city, but we've already searched them thoroughly. The location appears to have been abandoned long ago, so it appears that the trail ends there. Anything else, Knight? Any suggestions where I should look next? I'd pursue your lead regarding Dr. Amari. I'm not certain if she's a crackpot, or if she can genuinely assist your search. But our sources say she has some interesting technology at her disposal. Anything else, Knight? Not right now, Elder. Very well, then. Dismissed. <laughs>